Christina here with Saturday's workout of the day. So we have a fun one. It's a descending ladder of some snatches, some squats, and some burpees. So what we got? It's 40, 30, 20, 10 rep rounds for time of dumbbell or kettlebell snatches, dumbbell or kettlebell squats, and then every minute on the minute you're going to complete five burpees. So the flow, three, two, one, go. You're going to do your five burpees, and then you're going to pick up the dumbbell, do and start on your set of 40 dumbbell snatches. Um, try to get as far as you can, and then at the one minute mark, you'll do your burpees, and then two minute mark, and so on. So, but the rep scheme will go 40 snatches, 40 squats, 30, 30, 20, 20, 10, and 10. Once you're done with those, you're done. Um, for the burpees, if the five take longer than 20 seconds, you can go ahead and cut those down. It might be three burpees, it might be four burpees, but if it's exceeding longer than 20 seconds, then yeah, definitely cut it down because we want the majority of the workout or the minute to be put to the snatches and squats. All right, so dumbbell snatches, what that looks like is dumbbell starts from the ground. You're going to have your back flat, shoulders above the knees, or shoulders above the hips, hips above the knees, all the way up. If you want to transition fast, you can go ahead and transition in the air. If not, just reset it in between um, on the ground. Okay? The squats. Uh, if you have a lighter dumbbell or you want to add a little bit of tension, you can go ahead and hold it in this front rack position. I like it here because it's kind of more like a barbell front rack position. If not, and it's a little heavier, you can go ahead and rest it more here like a goblet um, squat or if it's super heavy, and you can go ahead and rest it on your shoulder as you go to the squats. Okay? Um, and yeah, so that's the workout. For your warm up, just go seven minutes dynamic range of motion, so move. But just to kind of get used to that EMOM, I want you to go five down ups every minute on the minute, also including zero. So down up, what that'll look like is you just go to the top of the push up position and then stand. And so on. Okay? Um, the second part of the warm up, you're going to use a PVC. And it'll start with just 10 PVC pass throughs. Try, and you're going to be doing this for two rounds. So, on the first round, go kind of slow. And then, second round, you kind of speed it up a little bit. But try to keep that core tight, midline tight. Second, PVC good mornings. So, it'll go on your back, soft knees here. Flat back, squeeze the butt on the way up. And then last for that part is 10 overhead squats. So we're getting ready for that burger warm up, skill transfer exercises. Lock those armpits into place, so armpits forward, elbow pits up. Use that first set to go nice and slow. And then in that second set, you can speed it up. And then once you're done with those, you're gonna go through that yet twice. And then burger warm up, skill transfer exercises. Make sure you do that. And then, yeah, just kind of prep your movements after that and have fun with the workout. Um, should be fun. Hopefully, I'll see you all at the 9 30 class. If not, enjoy your weekend. And yeah, we'll see you next week.